Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Block Center and please if you're new to the channel make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right now and also go to the notification bell icon click it and select all so anytime i drop in your bungle a new exclusive video you will definitely be notified and to my nine job brothers and sisters out there now god i take background make a lot of video share and subscribe because the more you share the video the more people to get to know about the channel the more we they grow because the more we grow the more highs go day for Niger boxing the more we will feel promote the underground boxers within Niger with the Africa in a way because my job and my aim my goal now to make sure say Niger boss a day for map you know, me so now let's get straight to you know for me i'm a Nigerian and i love it when fellow oh, yeah. Niger brothers support each other listen guys this is the first time i'm seeing this video i know that uh israel de Soya attended you know joshua ruiz uh rematch in saudi arabia uh, december 7 december 7th he was there i saw the a picture but i never saw him reacting to it in a way they were about and after seeing this video i'm just really really happy that israel de Soyan is one of those guys that listen like i always say nigerian athletes must support one another i don't want to hear say that's why i better pass joshua i understand say when the time reach to fight you feel talking here we want to talk but it is good to support each other in a way because the more you support each other the more you're giving exposure to a lot of other nigerians who are coming up to imitate the brotherhood mentality you know what i mean the brotherhood mindset to have that brotherhood mindset is very important i i, I noticed that you know nigeria being divided on ethnic tribal lines in a way sometimes you see people come on this channel and start spinning rubbish and i delete that i delete their comment immediately and i delete them and sometimes i block them because i'm not here for that negative vibe just because you know you are in nigeria like me and you make a mistake i cannot create it doesn't mean i can't criticize you of course i'll criticize you in a way but at the same time i will show you love and yes let's 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 watch this guys this is he's the same reacting to reacting to the region show about second the second bout commenting on it Listen, let me tell you one thing about Idra De Soya. This guy is a Nigerian at heart. You know, he was born in Nigeria, grew up around the world, especially in New Zealand. You know, represent New Zealand, represent Nigeria. But despite him being uh, and then, uh, like, uh, despite having dual citizenship in a way, he still doesn't forget about Nigeria. Listen, Nigeria is a country that keeps career when, for example, you are into a sport that's not popular, you into something that's not popular, that's, that people are not used to. Israel doesn't have been a UFC star in Nigeria, wouldn't, wouldn't have worked. Uh, there's no way he could have been a UFC superstar in Nigeria if he established himself in Nigeria. There's no way he could have because. In as much even boxing in Nigeria is not is not getting the recognition that it deserves because people are not like they don't see fighting as they see boxing as just people fighting. A lot of people still don't understand the science. A lot of people still don't understand it, the science behind you know boxing, you know in boxing because boxing is with science. It's not just about punching each other in the face. Isa Dasanya was of course a boxer first before he switched to kickboxing and then to MMA. You know. And despite this guy, you know, of course, probably having a hard chip growing up, you know what I mean, because we know how it is. And trying to figure out himself in a way and being frustrated and having the courage to still rip Nigeria. It's just something amazing, just so, something I want to see. Me as a Pagerian, I am definitely proud of, of what I do. I support our people, you know, worldwide, bold, young, old, you know what I mean, upcoming, known, uh, everyone and though people might say i criticize some people but at the same time i do that to motivate you to make 
you make the, the necessary move because I want to see you prosper. If I'm just a guy that's going to come here and, 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 and make some comment and just react to everything you do without, you know, without questioning your motives in a way, without questioning your move, because boxing is a very short term sport. And when you're in the game, you have to get your money and get out. And just the same, way as, the same way as fighting. Adesoya will be fighting Palo Costa 27th of September this month. And I cannot wait. I can't wait for that bout, man. Believe me, Adesoya is a monster to be reckon with. Palo Costa, on the other hand, is still undefeated. And it's definitely going to be con it's definitely going to come out going blazing, but I believe our brother Adesanya would just be too much for him. So you see, brother love, he strained love to Joshua. He went there, attended the bout, you know, to support his Nigerian, his fellow Nigerian brother. He didn't go there to see oh whether he go win or whether he go lose. He go, he went there to support, to support. That's why you also see. Joshua also tried support and they saw him, you know, he retweeted some of his stuff as well. I mean, I even they post some of his stuff on his story as well. And believe me, he's gonna do it again. I just I just like the fact that Joshua has a Pagerian mindset, the same way as a Desoya, same the same as Cameron Osman. You know, I want our brothers, other brothers to have that same mindset. Not just low key hating on the guy and saying or you know, I don't low key hate it. Like I understand that if you are in the same division and you you know in the same division, yeah, you can you can you you you, you expect to fight fight him one day because at the end of the day you guys are fighters. But we don't want to hear this uh, this uh, trash talk. You know what I mean? We don't want to hear our own TD fight upon when you fight up you fit us okay now nah, good because trash talk doesn't really do anything because you see like someone like Pereke. Uh, what was the last when was the last time you saw Pereke say, say rubbish about his opponent, regardless of who he fights? The last time that happened was when he fought by Miklishko. Proud, uh, I think it was uh, the build up to Klitschko but because Russia and Ukraine, you know, the thing there is this this um animosity you know between the two nations you know ukrainians don't really i don't know they don't they don't really appreciate like russians like that they don't appreciate the russian they, they think that russians you know have ruined their country in a way and you look at the crimea crisis and all the stuff i can understand the soviet union the ussr this kind of stuff that happened you know and um how ukraine is still suffering from you know all those political you know uh Chaos in a way, but Adesoya is a Pigeon at heart, and it's crazy. I didn't see this video before. First time seeing it, um, it's just interesting to see Adesoya supporting and the Joshua during the uh, junior rematch. And believe me, he's one of those guys that cause happy for Joshua, you know, um, after he won. I saw the clip he posted after Joshua won. But I never saw this, you know, he's kind of motivated Joshua and telling him like go hard and uh, do this, do that, you know. Stay blessed, young group, still more guys. Like I said, uh, make sure you like the video, make sure you share them, make sure you support the channel because sharing is scary. So go follow me on Instagram at uh, Boxing Blog Center, on Twitter at Boxing Blog, and as well on Facebook at Boxing Blogs. And I beg, I want to reach 1k followers for Instagram. I never see this, you don't tell you. Oh boy, you know, Miss Martin, no. Make sure at this Instagram self even easy to get followers. Make sure that you follow me for there now. I mean, I beg. I beg at the background so that make a start live show for there, you know, live boxing show because I go to invite people to talk. Stay blessed, brothers. Cheers.